Hello, we're here at Unified Tech 2014, and I'm standing here with Anthony Ha, who's a writer at TechCrunch. You just moderated a panel here called What's Next? So let me ask you, what's next? It, well, the challenge was trying to figure out what the heck that actually means. Um, I think we covered a lot of different things, but um, you know, a lot of it was about sort of the, the the agencies, basically how ad buying is done now and sort of the need to basically sort of tear down a lot of the silos, as much as that's a cliche, like really tear down the silos at a lot of the agencies so that like mobile ad buying isn't sort of this separate category, but it's in this sort of, you know, across all kinds of ad buying. You obviously, for TechCrunch, you write, you see a lot of trends. Where do you see the dollar shifting in the next year to year and a half? Uh, I'm going to have a really predictable answer, which is, you know, definitely it's going to continue to shift to mobile. I think also that it's going to be, you know, that most of the spending now is sort of on the traditional kind of banners that like no one likes. Um, and I think you're going to see more and more money going to native, um, and what, which means like 10 million different things, but different experiments with native, more on um, tablets. I think something that you're not going to see the dollar shift, but I think could have a lot of promise more years in the future would be, you know, other kinds of devices and wearables and things like that. But, you know, I think it's going to be a long time before we see, you know, significant spending there. You said personally what you would like to watch. So what kind of content do you like to watch? I mean, the last like online video I watched that was was actually an ad, and I watched the, it was it was, an, it was a YouTube pre-roll that I watched all three minutes of, which was the um, it was God, it was it was it was Smirnoff, it was the Smirnoff thing with um, I'm totally blanking now, Adam Scott and um, Allison Brie, which is like this like skit, basically about like a party, and it was like a, th a three-minute video that, but and then like Smirnoff just sort of gets dropped in there. And I mean, it was obviously an ad, but it was like so much more fun than most online advertising. Yeah, that's really interesting. And that's sort of the danger with native advertising, right? Is that, are we just all going to be watching ads all the time? Uh, I'm <laughs> I mean, I think we watch a lot of ads already, right? And I mean, we're, we're here in New York. We you know, may pass Times Square and see all the ads. I don't think, you know, it's... Um, I mean, I guess there is a there is an element of danger to that, um, but, uh, and, and I think it's more that it's, it's not a question, I mean, I th you know, if someone chooses, knows some, goes, goes in knowing something is advertising and watches it anyway, like, it's hard to get too worked up about that. I mean, certainly that's why, you know, everyone talks about, like, the Super Bowl, right, and half the reason you watch is for the ads, especially if, like me, you don't understand football. Um, but, like, and, and maybe, like, if, if that happens sort of en masse, or maybe it has already happened en masse, that's something to be worried about, but I think it, what I would be more worried about, at least on a smaller level is more just when it's tricking people into thinking oh this is actually real content when oh and like it's not clear that it's being sponsored by someone now if you had to boil it down to one piece of advice for marketers coming off of the event today and what we talked about is could you do that yes so my one piece of advice would be don't think of mobile as sort of a separate channel um, Think of it as something that applies across all your different um, forms of advertising. Uh, and I feel very confident saying that because I'm basically stealing it from my panelists. Okay. Yeah, we're he hearing that a lot today at Unify Tech, and that's sort of what Unify Tech is, isn't it?